everyone and welcome back to my channel! Oh my god, welcome back to another Boohoo haul. These are literally one of my absolute favourite, favourite things to watch and I recently made one on my channel and it went down really, really well and yeah, since then things have been super, super exciting. Um, I just want to say, and I'm absolutely ecstatic to say, that all of these clothes have been very kindly gifted to me by Boohoo, um, which I can't believe I'm saying, um, but all of the opinions that I give um, will be completely honest and will be my own opinions whether or not I bought the clothes or not, they would still be my opinions. And yeah, it's just such an incredible thing and I just don't want to forget this moment. I just, I'm so, so grateful for everyone who's watched my videos, who subscribe to my channel, um, and yeah, everyone that sort of made this possible because this is absolutely like surreal. So, if you are new to my channel, um, my name's Kellyanne, and I make videos on weight. Well, I started my um, my YouTube channel because of I wanted to document my weight loss journey. Um, I'm also trying to be body confident in the skin that I'm currently um, living in. <laughs> um, I'm like a size. 16, um, UK size 16, um, and yeah, I I love buying clothes, I buy a lot of clothes, so uh, yeah, I've been putting a lot of um, curvy try-on hauls on my channel, and everyone seems to really enjoy them, so yeah, so today we're doing another Boohoo one. So, Boohoo um, actually said to me, you know, you've got 200 pound, go and enjoy it, spend it on whatever you want um, on the website, so I did. Um, I bought things like joggers, I bought blazers, I bought shoes, I bought pajamas, because obviously I had to buy a new pair of pajamas. Um, what else have I bought? I bought a co-ward set, I've got dresses, I've got such a mix of different, different things. Um, and I'm so, so excited to show you what they look like. And um, probably just like everyone, the weather's been really, really lovely, and you kind of just want some new, fresh stuff to sort of go with old stuff and to sort of like bring it to life a little bit more or generally you just want a bit of a change and obviously every year your personality and the things that you like changes so I guess it's always really really nice to go and buy yourself something new so yeah so I'm going to go through each of these items I'm going to show you what everything looks like on again as I said I'll be completely honest how things fit me um as you may have seen from previous videos, if you are a long-term subscriber, I carry a lot of my weight in my hips and in my belly. I was gonna say my bum, but not really in my bum. But yeah, so let's get into it and let's see what everything looks like. Right, okay, so the very first thing that I um, that I picked up that went into my um, basket was this really, really beautiful um, pearl headband. I haven't got that many headbands at all and then um, when I was on the website I was looking through because I was actually looking for scrunchies which I'll get on to in a second um, but yeah I was looking through and I was like why don't I really have that many headbands there's so many nice headbands on there um, they had like bigger ones they had um, like jeweled ones and stuff like that but I thought with my hair colour um, I just thought the pearl one would look really really nice um, so yeah, so that was the, the first thing that I picked up, but I also thought it would go really nice with one of the outfits that I've got coming up, so yeah, stay tuned for that. Okay, so getting on to some clothing things now, um, as I mentioned, I picked up a co-ward set, um, I actually picked this up in a size 18, um, as you may have seen if you've watched previous haul videos of, um, of mine, I carry a lot of weight in my hips and around my stomach area um, so I'm always a little bit conscious about ordering bottoms and things like that so I ordered this in a size 18 and it is this absolutely beautiful sort of yellow daisy print um, cohort this is the the bandeau top um, and this is the bottoms that go with it which is actually a skirt it's a long maxi skirt um, it's got two slits down the front um, to obviously go sort of between your legs. I actually saw someone on, uh, what was it, Love Island, Australia, not long ago, actually what, wearing something quite similar to this, and I really, really like the style of it. So it's not something I've got anything like in my wardrobe, but I really love yellow. Um, and so yeah, I thought I would give it a try and see what it looks like. So yeah, I know you can't really see it very well right now but i'm sure you'll be able to see it better in the try on clip okay so this is the little yellow and 
white cord set on um as i said it's quite sort of a slinky material so i have put on my um bridget jones knickers to smooth everything out um i actually really really like it i really like these little um slits up the leg i feel kind of very um i want to say grecian but i don't think that is actually the the actual thing only thing <laughs> The only thing, and it is the only thing, I would say is that for my height, it is very, very long. Um, I would need my nan to chop off the um, the bottom of it. But other than that, I really like it. I love the colour. I think the material is so sort of light and really, really nice for this weather. Um, I would say if you're thinking about buying this, I would definitely size up because I think the 16 would have been too clingy on me um, if you've got a similar shape as me but yeah overall i really really like it so um, yeah i'll be looking forward to wearing this in the summer okay so the next item i want to show you is called the floral spot print ruffle tea dress and i got it in a size 16 again i'll leave all of the links down below um and it looks like this it's got these sort of um little puffy sleeves there it's this beautiful white and stone print with um, with these pink roses on them and then I really really like liked the neckline I don't know how well you can sort of see it's kind of a little sort of key is it a keyhole neckline when it's got a little gap that ties up and um, again it comes in at the waist and it's got a dropped hem I really really just wanted um, like another another little summery dress to wear um, again going from my wardrobe I was kind of missing a little bit of colour so um, yeah so I picked that up and um, from Boohoo. So this is the stone um, coloured polka dot rose sort of dress and um, you'll see at the bottom again it's got the drop hem that I really really like. I absolutely love all of this detail around here um, and even the little puffy sleeves as well I think that is super super cute. I would definitely definitely wear this um, maybe to work with a pair of nice um, nice shoes. I've actually got a white pair of shoes that look really nice with this. Um, or you could literally wear it to like a brunch or to like a lovely day out. Um, but I really, really like it. I mean, at the moment, it's a little bit more snug around this area than I would prefer it to be. Um, but I still feel really, really nice in it and I think it's lovely. So yeah, I really, really like this. Okay, so the next thing I want to show you is this beautiful... I've lost the tag already. Is this absolutely beautiful, um, is it coal, cobalt blue? Anyway, it's a type of blue. Um, this blue little strappy dress. Um, I actually put this on yesterday. Um, I filmed this on Sunday. I put this on yesterday because I was hoping to wear it for my sister's 30th birthday. Um, but unfortunately, you know, the weather just decided to be really windy and rainy and cold. So I had this on for about 10 minutes and then I took it off and put jeans on. Um, but I thought it was really, really nice. When I saw it on the website, it was a colour that I don't usually go for. Um, and I've recently bought a new sports bra in this blue colour. And it's the first thing like this that I've got in my wardrobe. Um, and when I saw the colour against my skin and against my hair, I really, really liked it. So yeah, I was really, really drawn to it on the website. But um, yeah, so this is it. And again, I got it in a size 16. This is the little blue on my... Um, dress with the little ruffle detail at the bottom. Again, I really, really like this. The material again is that sort of, sort of, I wouldn't say it's, what would I say it is? I'd say it's like stretchy kind of material. Um, you've got some room in there. Um, I really, really like the top as well. As I said, this isn't a colour that I would usually pick for myself. Um, but my sports bra that I've been wearing is literally this colour and I've sort of started to really like it from that. Um, but yeah, I really, really like it. Again, if you're a similar size to me, um, you may want to size up or it may just be that I'm, you know, ate a lot over the weekend. But it is obviously more of a fitted dress. Um, and then you get to the bottom and it kind of flares out. But yeah, I would wear this literally um, with maybe one of my denim jackets over the top um, and some white sandals. The next item is a top and this one is called the Woven Ruched Puff Sleeve Top Black 16. So it's colour black in a size 16. Um, and it is this gorgeous little square neck crop top um it's got all gathered sleeves down um gathered 
gathered sleeves down the arm. It's all gathered down the arm. Um, it's got these kind of like poofy sleeves and then it's gathered and sort of tapered in um, at the front and at the back. I just thought it looked really, really nice. Um, and I haven't got anything like this in my wardrobe, so I was really sort of drawn to it. I think they also had it in ivory as well. Um, or it might have been like a stony colour, but I thought the black one was just something that you always, always need in your wardrobe. Um, it's got a little zip down the side as well to get you in and out of it. Um, and yeah, I kind of thought, do you know what? If they did this in a dress, like this kind of style with gathering all down the sides of the hips maybe. I think that would be really, really flattering. Um, so I'm going to have to keep an eye out for that actually. But yeah, so I picked this up in a size 16. This is the little black top that's got all of the ruching up both of the arms. It's got sort of this milkmaid style sort of square neck. Um, and then the, the back as well, it's got quite a low, um, a low back and it's sort of gathered as well. I really, really like this. Um, I'm thinking what I would quite like to put with it is a skirt and I don't have a skirt that I could try on with it at the moment but I'm thinking a nice black skirt would look really really nice with it and maybe a blazer if I've got this headband in as well I don't know that's what I'm kind of thinking with it I think it needs a skirt so yeah I don't have one to try on right now I've literally just put it on with a pair of trousers at the moment but for a size 16 I'm really really happy with it it's a shorter crop than a longer one for anyone who's um, interested in this at all but yeah generally I think it looks really really nice if you put a little bit of highlighter in your um, in your collarbones and stuff I think you'd really like it but yeah I'm really happy with this and I think this is the kind of thing that you would keep for years because you'll put it with so many different things but yeah I'm fishing in a skirt because I haven't got any skirts and I think I've seen an outfit that I would quite like to recreate. <laughs> the next thing I want to show you is called the white polka dot print frill tea dress <laughs> Got Mr. Word out then, and it literally is just this just super super cute little white and black polka dot tea dress. Um, it's got a little tie detail at the back as well, so you can cinch yourself in. Um, it's kind of like a t shirt material, so obviously super super comfortable for this weather. Um, but yeah, it's got a little ruffle down the front, and to be honest, I think these kind of dresses are really um, they're really. <laughs> I find them quite flattering on my on my figure because I come in at the waist but obviously I come back out again and because this is sort of the natural shape of this dress, I don't know, I just feel like it works quite well for me. Um, but yeah, I really, really liked it. Again, I got it in a size 16 and it's just something that I don't already have in my wardrobe. Um, so yeah, so I picked that one up. Okay, so I've got on the little white and black wrap dress, skater dress. Oh, what's it, what is it even called? What is this dress called? A tea dress? A tea dress. Right, I've got on this dress. I'm sorry if you're struggling to see it against the, the background. Um, again, it's, I really like this. I think this is so, so nice. Um, again, it's got the little dropped hem bit at the bottom, which I really, really like. Um, it's sort of a wrap around detail. It's not a real wrap, but there's quite a lot of wrap here, so it doesn't feel too, sort of, like, open. That makes sense um yeah i just generally really like it it's really really thin it's really fine i think for the price it is it's like perfect the material isn't thick it's not like super super expensive material it's sort of like casual t-shirt material which i suppose is exactly what a lot of people want for this kind of weather but yeah it's something that i don't have a black and white spotty dress like this so i thought you know what it'd be really really nice just to have one um i would actually if i i suppose you could wear it no, do you know what? I would probably wear it in the late summer. I'd probably put a denim jacket over it or a leather jacket and some sandals or some flip-flops. I wouldn't wear tights with it because it's white. Um, but yeah, generally, I really, really like it. I like the arms as well. Um, yeah, I just think it's, it's really, really nice. I really like it. And I really like it on. So, the next item is a little bit of Disney. I had to add a little bit of Disney into the haul. Um, and these pyjamas were new in on the website and I had to pick them up. Um, so, they are these beautiful Aristocat um, pyjamas. Obviously, they've got all of the Aristocat kittens on there with this sort of pink detailing at the top. Um, the actual top to this pyjama set 
is a one of the shirt ones that I really really like the style of this one has got long sleeves um, and a buttoned sort of down the front I was thinking this would be really really good if you if you go on holiday or obviously if you're away over the summer sometimes obviously accommodation has air conditioning and I just think sometimes of an evening you can actually feel a bit chilly so it's quite nice to have shorts with a longer top or longer trousers with a shorter top I don't know I just always think that works quite well when you're away um but yeah I saw these and I thought I have to pick them up I would say the material has very little stretch in it um and the shorts are pretty small for a 16 but I think the print is super super cute and you don't often get all of the um aristocat kittens on on any kind of item i don't usually see them all, all together at once anyway you usually only see marie so yeah i saw these and i had to had to order them so these are the aristocat pajamas i have to say i've put these on and i really i do really really like them however the shorts are so tight um they're not going to be super comfortable to for me to sleep in um yeah that is the only thing that i would say the top i really really like the bottoms kind of cling to my hips a little bit the material is a really weird material it's kind of like soft but it's it's got like basically no stretch to it whatsoever however the print i really really love i don't if you've seen sort of previous videos of mine anyway you'll see that we've got a little gray um cat called tiki and um, who's actually named after the enchanted tiki rooms in disney world we're huge disney disney fans um disney disney we're huge disney fans and we have actually got a couple's um florida sort of holiday vlog channel as well called woody's box which i'll leave below if you haven't already seen it um but when i went onto the website i love that boohoo have a disney sort of collaboration going on so i always look to see what new disney stuff they've got um, and when i saw this i was like oh my god it's got all the it's got all the aristocats on it and the print and the design i think is super super cute so the next thing i want to show you is this pink sort of patterned Okay, it looked so pretty on the model. I don't know what the model's name is, but she's the blonde, um, I think she's the plus size model, and she's absolutely stunning. Anyway, she was wearing this, um, this little skirt with a white top, and she looked so beautiful in it, so I had to order it. Um, I would say that it does look quite small, um, so I have to, you know, see how that turns out. Um, but yeah, I think it looks lovely. The print is really, really pretty. They did loads of different prints, actually. Um, and I was just thinking of a little vest top or a little t-shirt, a little denim jacket, some sandals. It would look really, really nice. So um, yeah, that again was super, super affordable as well. And I probably said it already, but I got it in a size 16. Okay, so I just want to show you the little pink skirt with the ruffle sort of detail down the front. Um, unfortunately, I tried this on and it just didn't fit me properly at all it was way too small for me um so although the print is lovely and i know they did other colors in it as well um yeah if you're thinking about getting this i would suggest sizing up maybe one or two sizes um but it's such a shame but i'm gonna keep hold of it as i said probably earlier on and you I may already know that i'm um currently losing weight at the moment so i'm gonna keep hold of this um because i just think tucked into a little vest top on holiday or you know out and about in the summer with some nice white sandals um would be really really nice so yeah i'm definitely gonna um keep hold of it so the next thing i want to show you is a pair of shorts that are literally for um for being at home in really they're not shorts to be worn out um or anything like that but they are these little shorts and they're called tall lightweight melange running short in um gray and again i got them in a size 16 and they look like this they're sort of quite loose they're like kind of see-through woven material i actually used to have that's what i used to have i used to have a cardigan like this years ago from h&m um in this kind of material but yeah they're super super flowy and i just thought you know for lounging around the house and being in the garden sometimes you want to wear shorts that are not cycling shorts um, and obviously i love cycling shorts but sometimes you want something a little bit more comfortable so yeah i picked those up in a size 16. okay right so this next item looks a little bit weird i'm not gonna lie they are really comfortable though although they're not super trendy on me they are like this woven material short 
um, they kind of they kind of hit me at a funny length. They're not when I saw these on the website, I wasn't thinking of them to wear them sort of out and about. Um, for me, I just wanted like a really comfortable pair of shorts to wear at home. Um, I got them in a size 16, and do you know what? For for doing exactly what I want to do with them, which is sort of like gardening or jobs around the house, when you just want a pair of comfortable shorts that are not cycling shorts, these are literally exactly, exactly what I needed. Fashion forward thing on me. I mean, other people might be able to pull them off way better than me, um, but for, ex for what I wanted them for, I think they're perfect. So these next things, these, things that I'm going to show you. I saw these on the website and I have not got a pair of white sandals and I was literally, I was going to a work meeting last week and the outfit that I was wearing would have looked really really nice with a pair of white sandals and I thought I've probably had some years ago and probably thrown them away and um, so I picked up these. Let me get the other one, let me get the other one. Right okay so this is what they, this is what they look like. They're the kind of square toe kind of sandals i as i said i've never had um a pair of white sandals but i've never had any in this style there's a girl that i follow on um instagram called keely um her fashion sense and home is just absolute goals but she wears um sandals like this in black with a dress and they looked so so nice so when i saw the white ones i was like right definitely definitely ordering um i did put my foot in them earlier I'm not flexible enough to, to bend my uh, my foot upwards, but the size 6 fits me really, really well. Um, and yeah, I just thought they looked really, really nice. And I thought with white, they'd look really nice with jeans as well. So again, they were super, super reasonably priced. Um, and I will leave the link down below. But something... Oh also carrying on talking about them something I, I also really liked is that they were padded because you know um, I don't know if anyone else is the same sometimes when you pick sandals and they've got like a flat bottom a flat bottom when they're like really hard at the bottom they really burn your feet when you wear them so I really like that these were squishy because they're the kind of things that I really really like so yeah really really happy with these again just want to do a couple more little bits and pieces actually I take this one out Boohoo very kindly send, sent me this very cute little headband, which I'm probably going to get makeup all over now. I've never ever had, yeah, I don't think I've ever had something like this before. I thought this was so, so cute. And I thought, you know what, when I'm taking my makeup off of an evening or doing a face mask, it'd be really, really nice. And actually talking about face masks. There was a lovely little extra package in my Boohoo order. Um, they sent me the Coconut Rescue um, hair mask, which looks really, really nice. You can use it from the um, the hair... Oh, you can use it from the root as well. I've never, ever tried that, but I really like the smell of coconut, so I'm sure I would really, really like that. They also sent these moisture Garnier Moisture Bomb eye bag reducing tissue mask um this has got orange juice and high 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 hyaluronic acid in them um i use that hyaluronic acid thing already um but yeah i thought that was really really sweet of them to send me that because i you know of an evening when you're doing like a pamper night it's always nice to like have new stuff to try um, and they also sent me a purifying honey boohoo face mask so i'm gonna be using these with this probably we'll do another little pamper video as well because i haven't done one of those for ages um and sometimes you just need a bit of tlc don't you, you just need to like have a nice bath or a nice shower do your hair do your nails tint your eyebrows do that kind of thing put a face mask on so yeah i thought that was really really nice of them so thank you boohoo for sending me those they were a very very nice little bonus also talking about little accessories um Again, really, really late to the party on this one. I have not had any scrunchies since I was in primary school, but I'll take this one out, replace it with a new one. I saw this little three pack and it's got a nude one with black dots, a white one with black dots and a black one with white dots. I thought they was nude, but they're not. Um, and they were a little three pack and I thought, do you know what? That's exactly what I need. I really need ones that have got like a couple of different um, different styles to different styles different colors to them even let's see what this looks looks like we've all free in my hair it does feel lighter actually i've got very heavy hair i mean you can't see anything at all but 
it feels nice. So yeah, that was a lovely little bonus. So yeah, that was um, a really nice little accessory that I've never had that I'm going to be looking forward to using. Okay, so moving on to some more sort of things that I actually really quite needed. Um, I picked up these really beautiful tie-dye loop back joggers. I saw from one of the YouTubers that I watch, um, she told she told me, she told her, um, she said on her video that loop back a really really good quality so when I saw that that's what they were called I was like oh I have to give them a try um, and again they're sort of 90s style a nice big um, waistband at the top that you can like flip over if you want to um, and again I just think the print of them is really really nice so yeah I wanted to try them um, and I picked them up in a size 16 and the colour is charcoal I really really like them um, I was trying to find something grey in my wardrobe to wear on top but I haven't got anything in this colour grey um, also the top um, that I'm wearing is white and these are sort of like a creamy colour so I think I would need like a creamy creamy or a greyish kind of colour to go with them um, but I really really like the fit of them they fit really Ooh, doing a little dance <laughs> they fit really nice I really really like tie dye and I've seen some people actually wear um wear tie dye there's a girl actually I used to go to school with who did a tie dye tracksuit and I thought it looked so cool but I'm not brave enough to do it myself so I'd rather buy it um so yeah this kind of filled my little tie dye um need okay on to another pair of um joggers again these are called loop back joggers as well but these feel more of a thinner kind of material they don't feel half as thick as those ones and they are these beautiful tie-dye ones again gathered at the bottoms um they don't have a tie in waist so you can't adjust them like that but i'm sure if you wanted to you could sort of roll them up and down um yeah i just really like the color of them i thought they looked really really pretty and i thought you know with like a little white um crop top or something like that they would look really really nice um and again i picked these up in a size 16 and the color is called sky <laughs> Okay, so I've also got on the multicoloured tie-dye joggers. Um, these ones are more slinky. I much prefer the other ones on me. I think where, I don't know, I feel, kind of feel like I'm wearing my pyjamas in these ones, which isn't a bad thing, because I do love my pyjamas. But out of the two, I prefer the more subtle grey and white print. Okay, so I personally think I've saved the best item till last. This was on the new in section of the website, and I absolutely love it it's absolutely beautiful and it is this cream woven let me do it justice cream woven blazer that's got these beautiful buttons they're sort of white and black almost tortoise shell buttons and um, there's two down the front and again two on the other other arm um I think this looks so expensive, like so, so expensive. Um, and I just absolutely loved it. I haven't got a blazer. I've got a white blazer, but I don't have like a creamy color blazer. Um, and I just thought, you know what, with like so many different outfits, this would look really, really nice. So also I have to say the price that this was on on the website was crazy money. So this was, oh, this color's ivory and I got it in a size 14. I don't think there was a 16, otherwise I probably would have got a 16. But I remember looking at the price thinking, oh my god, that price is absolutely incredible for that. So yeah, I'm really, really loving this. I am actually obsessed with this. I, I love it so, so much. So I was literally thinking, what, should, what can I wear with this blazer? And when I was trying on all these different outfits, I could have put maybe three or four different outfits together. So first thing that I would wear this like is to work. So I'd literally wear like a little white t-shirt i really love white and cream together or a white blouse um with the cream jacket i've got some black um sort of slim black trousers on which i would wear again with maybe some loafers and my black handbag you could also wear this with a bralette with a pair of jeans um tucked in tucked in worn with some heels um i had a nude bag as well which i could have put on with these pink um checkered paper bag trousers that i had there's literally so many different things that this color would go with i love this kind of like woven look i think it looks so expensive and the price of it was not expensive at all um but yeah i thought when i when i was picking out my um pearl 
headbands i was like this would look so nice with this cream blazer and i know some people will buy them really really oversized and belt them and make them into a dress um, I'm kind of at the top end of the normal clothing sizes, so I'm like a size 16. Um, if you was maybe a size 6 or an 8 or a 10, then I think this size would work really, really well. But I'm, from memory, I think this went up to a size 16. I'm sure the plus section probably had their own version as well. Um, but I absolutely love it. I think it looks really put together, which I am not a put together person. So yeah, I really, really like this. So I would 100, 100% recommend it. Um, and I'm gonna definitely look and see if they've got this woven one in any other colors as well. But yeah, I know I've probably rambled for such a long time about this blazer, but I really, really like it. <laughs> So yeah, that is everything from the uh, the try on and close section of my video. I just wanted to say the absolute biggest, biggest, biggest thank you for Boohoo, to Boohoo for wanting to work with me and send me these beautiful items to, to try out. It's actually been a dream come true, so I'm so, so grateful. Um, and yeah, I'm not you know, taking it for granted. I'm super, super chuffed about it. Um, yeah, don't forget that Boohoo gave me a discount code, which is Boohoo Babe UK, and you can get 32% off new in items and 10% off things in the sale, which obviously is incredible. Um, so yeah, I loved, I loved filming this video. I hope you guys really loved it. I hope you guys really enjoyed watching it. Um, thank you to everyone who's subscribed to my channel and followed me um, and supported me. It actually means the world. It obviously enables things like this to happen. So yeah, I just wanted to say a massive thank you to you too. Um, but yeah, I hope to see you all really, really soon for another video. Sorry about that. I hope to see you really soon for another video. Um, and take care. Bye. <laughs>